Hi friends, I often leave my house, but I have to constantly keep an eye on my sites and channels. For this, I take with me a smartphone. If I want just to talk, I usually use a simple dialer. Smartphone battery charge is enough for a few hours, so I'm looking for a portable charger. I have this, but it is big and it's not convenient to carry in pocket. So I decided to make a simple yet powerful power bank. The project was implemented with the use of our ready-made modules. Links to them are under the video. Corpse is a plastic box from other Chinese power bank, and it fits four lithium batteries of a 18650 type. They are used batteries from a laptop, and the total capacity is about 8200 microamperes. Battery voltage is 3.7 volts, but we need 5 volts to charge. To increase the voltage, I use the model of DC-DC converter based on the XL6009 chip. You can use also these modules, but they became very hot at currents about 1 amperes. The previous module is more powerful and can simultaneously charge two or even three smartphones. The next module is a battery charge controller from the USB port. It is based on the TR4056 chip, is protected from the charge reduction, overload and charge circuit. The board has two LEDs, one lit during the charging process and the second at the end of it. This module has a micro USB connector to which is fed 5 volts. All necessary connections are clearly written on modules. Also, I need a switch, two 3mm LEDs and two USB female connectors. First, we must connect all four batteries in parallel. Of course, the number may be different. In my case, the quantity is determined by the size of box. I soldered them with soldering iron, despite the fact that I have a device for their welding. But I'm too lazy to get it out of the attic. Next, we need to set up DC-DC converter. To do this, connect the module input to any 3.724 volts power supply. For example, a lithium battery or a laboratory power supply. Turn the variable resistor until the output will be 5 volts. This completes the setting. Little remake of the charge controller board was done. I replaced the SMD's LEDs to 3mm LEDs, because we will set them to the front panel. At box, I did all the necessary holes. Now needs to connect all under this scheme. I also added LED indication, if the power bank turned on. This is pin out of the USB connector. Notice the data pins are close to each other. All fixed with hot glue. I wrapped box in leather sheath. I think it's looking nice. As a result, my old Sony smartphone is charged 3 to 4 times through this device. It is enough. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day. With you was Akakasyan.